Hello, in the next few minutes, I would like to show you how to best calibrate IEP pressure sensors with short time constant, such as our 601C, 603C and 6233B. These sensors are ideally suited for highly dynamic environments. Thanks to their high pass behavior, which will eliminate drift and DC offset while maintaining the dynamic components of the signal, such as pressure oscillations and shock wave fronts. Let's start by taking a look at some general limitations when calibrating piezoelectric pressure sensors. We are normally limited in the maximum measuring time for a calibration by two effects. The first effect is the drift of a piezoelectric measuring chain. This will introduce an error to your calibration which grows linearly with time. The second effect is again a speciality of piezoelectric measuring chains. Because infinite insulation would be required for a perfectly static signal, we always have a slight high pass behavior of our measuring chain. For a static signal, this would result in a decrease as shown here, with the signal losing 63% of its amplitude per time constant. Our quasi-static amplifiers have time constant of approximately 100,000 seconds. Both of these effects limit how long a calibration of a piezoelectric measuring chain is allowed to take. Here you can see how the measuring time affects the error depending on the sensor's charge output. As we are now focusing on IEP sensors with a fixed short time constant, we need to revisit the limitations for the measuring time. Drift will no longer introduce an error to our calibration because low frequency content, such as amplifier drift, is eliminated by the high pass behavior of our short time constant. While this is extremely beneficial for many applications, it complicates things when we come to the calibration. A short time constant in our IEP pressure sensors is in the range of 0.5 to 5 seconds. As we have learned before, this means a static amplitude would be decreased by 63% during these 0.5 to 5 seconds respectively. Therefore, we need a shorter measuring time than most calibration systems provide. At Kistler, we use a pressure pulse system such as this one. With it, we can calibrate our 601, 603C and 6233B sensors, as well as other mounting compatible solutions. The system generates a pulse between 2 and 10 milliseconds. This allows an accurate calibration of these sensors by drastically shortening the measuring time compared to other established quasi-static calibration systems. We have found shorter pulses to introduce new sources of errors. For example, we have observed that with pulses significantly shorter than 2 milliseconds, it cannot be guaranteed that the pressure is distributed uniformly throughout the medium. This introduces critical measurement errors. In short, we suggest using a pressure pulse of 2 to 10 milliseconds to calibrate piezoelectric pressure sensors with a short time constant. For more detailed expertise on the ideal procedure for the calibration of your specific sensors, please do reach out to your Kistler representative. And for more short bursts of information, visit our Explained in X Minutes playlist.